This problem is from 2022 China's Math Olympia. It is a geometry problem. A convex quadrilateral ABCD is drawn here with a property that ABC is a right angle. ADC is also a right angle, 90 degrees. We try to prove BD equal to XY, XY here. So here BD diagonal, we have a point P such that this angle here, APB, the bigger one, is twice the smaller one here, the CPD. We have another pair of similar relationship here, that is the bigger triangle X here, right, the bigger triangle here, is twice the angle BDA, okay? Now, the other bigger triangle here, AYD, this bigger one, Y here, is twice of a b d okay so and then we try to prove b d is twice this lens is twice of x y all right let's do some analysis here now notice that whenever you see this right triangle here they add up to 180 degrees then a b c d are on a circle that's a good information you want to catch right so in other words um, we need to know when four points on a circle we have this relationship okay so the angle subtended by the same arc a b is the same in other words in this case alpha equal beta another thing is that the converse is true yeah so that's a theorem right saying that if alpha equal beta in this case and then ABCD would be on a circle. Okay, we're not going to prove this. This proof can be proved by contradiction, right? So I'm not going to go into details. The highlight idea is that assume they're not on the same circle, and let's find a circumcircle ABC in a circle here. If D is either outside or inside, in both cases you're going to have contradiction because by the property that a, B, C, and D prime is uh, there on the circle, so alpha will equal beta prime, but beta prime must equal beta, right? W which is impossible in this case. Anyway, let's take that as a fact, all right? So another useful property is that if you connect C, D here, you know, the angle here, uh, the opposing angle or complement with each other, 180 degrees, okay, and vice versa, right? So we use this fact in this problem extensively, okay? Let's go back to the problem. So here, as we mentioned earlier, ABC 90 degrees, ADC is 90 degrees, they're going to be on a circle, and AC is going to be the diameter, right? So let's do that. So the center of the circle is O, we connect, you know, OX and OY, and we need to prove XY is half of BD. Now, usually, for this kind of relationship, you want to find a similar triangle, because in geometry, either the sides are congruent, if the sides in certain ratio, then you probably want to do some similar triangles. Okay, let's that's our go. All right, how to go about doing that? Okay, let's start with the given fact that uh, the angles have certain relationship here, okay? So here we claim that AOB, which is not connected here, but imagine AOB, which is inner angle here, inner angle of the circle is twice of BDA. Okay, ADB, so AOB is twice of ADB. Now earlier we we're, were given that ADB is half of this big triangle here, uh, sorry, big angle here, AXB, right? So that's given, okay? Now from there, what are we going to have? We have that AXOB are on a circle, why? Because AOB equal a x b so by the earlier theorem 
it's going to be a same circle okay now similarly for the other side a y o d let's look at that so in this case a o d okay a o d right a o d is equal to a b d similar argument a b d but earlier we we're saying that a b d is a half of this y triangle here right a y d so in this case we claim because a o d a y d the angle the angles are equal so a y o d are on a circle right now with that we can do, do some analysis about the angles here okay so here we start with o x a yeah o x a here equal o b a okay o x a equal o b a because earlier we say a b x o are on same circle right now here because o is the center of the circle o a o b equal to each other so these two angles equal to each other so we got this okay now similarly let's look at this right so here what happens is for this triangle here this angle here right you can look at the bigger triangle here right so b c d a are on same circle so angle b a c equal b d c all right so here all four angles equal to each other what we care about is this one this and that one equal to each other okay so another direction here the a y o d on the same circle so this angle will equal this okay so exterior angle equal the opposing interior angle here right so this is a property of uh, consecutive points on a circle okay now use a similar argument o a o d equal to each other so this angle equal to each other and use a similar argument look at the bigger one the d a c is equal d b c because a b c d are in the same circle right so we have another pair of congruent angles here right that is this one equal that one so now you have spot d similar triangles okay these two are similar why because all the angles are congruent with each other this equal to this that one equal to that one all right that's good so now we need to argue the ratio is one to two okay so how would you do that now notice that there's one pair of relation we have not used yet that is this smaller triangle is half of this bigger track uh, uh, smaller angle is half of a p b you know d p c is half of a p b all right so let's extend it out let's look at that so here cp is bisector of this angle here right so we're extending the 9 ap here we're going to do cs perpendicular to the 9 ct perpendicular since this is angle bisector we know that cs equals ct okay oh there's a typo here sorry about that this should be cs now in this or perpendicular right or is going to be parallel to cs and o is the center here ao equal oc so we know that r is going to be center of as in the meantime or is going to be half of cs okay so or is half of cs or cs is twice of or and this is the type of here ct equals cs so we know that ct here ct 
is tricep OR. And we're done, right? Because we have similar triangle. Yeah, we have similar triangle. The attitude is 2 to 1 ratio. So the size must also be because the size and attitude are in proportional. Okay? So in other words, BD over XY is going to be the same ratio of the CT over OR, which is true. So we reach the conclusion that's the proof. Okay? As a recap, so what we did is based on the given angle relationship, we argue that ABXO on the same circle, AYOD on the same circle, and of course ABCD on the same circle. From there, we argue that similar triangles, and then we make the uh, you know the line here so that we argue the attitude is two to one ratio, and then from there we say that BD equal two of XY. Okay, this is an interesting problem. Hope you like and share.